Welcome back. In this video, I'll be working, I'll be solving problems on indices. I have question one, two, three, four. Let me start with one and two, and the other I will continue with this, the rest. Now, the first one solution. Solution. I have eight raised to power one all over three multiplied by five raised to power two all over three. All divided by 10 raised to power 2 all over 3. <clears throat> if I have this type of problem, how will I do? 2 raised to power 3 is equals to 8. Therefore, I can express this as 2 raised to power 3. Please introduce bracket. Now, I have this outside. Multiply by 5. There's nothing you can do to this 5 because it's a prime number. I have 2 all over 3 all divided by this my ten. i can express it as two times five all bracket of two all over three please bracket shows that this belongs to and this belongs to therefore this we cancel this left two raised to power one multiplied by five raised to power two all divided i mean divided by three all divided by now this can be two raised to power two all over three Multiply by 5 raised to power 2 all over 3. Now, something is very good there. I think they are the same thing and they are in ratio form. Now, this can cancel this. Left with 2 raised to power 1 divided by 2 raised to power 2 all over 3. Now, they are on the same base, which is the same number powering number. Now, therefore, I can say that what? Go back to your log 2, which we have pause to explain that 2 one minus two all over three now i need to find the lcm the lcm is three three times one which is three two raised to power three minus two all over three which it will give us what two raised to power one all over three now i can now write this as cube root of three and two Powering one. That is solution number one. Number two. We have a decimal here. This is a decimal form. Therefore, how do I solve? I have this. I have eight. I have powering three. I have multiply. I have zero point zero five or bracket of two divided by. Now, how do I solve this type of problem? Now, I can express this as, let me take them to fraction. You know, if I have them in fraction, to be very, 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 very good. Now, 8 divided by 10, or 3, multiplied by, also, I have 5 divided by 100, or bracket of 2, B, all divided by, now, I cannot have this as, 32 divided by 100. No power, nothing. Yeah. Now, what can I do next? I can express this as what? 2 raised to power 3. 2 raised to power 3, all bracket of 3, divided by 10 raised to power 3, multiplied by 5 raised to power 2, divided by, this one will be what? 10 raised to power 2, which is 10 raised to power 2 is 100, and this. Two belongs to both, which is what? Four. I can now put my division, which is 32 will give us what? Two raised to power five. Two raised to power five will give us 32. And divided by 100 will give us two raised to power two. Two raised to power two. Now, now I have two raised to power nine. I have divided by 10 raised to power 3 multiply by this also will give me 5 raised to power 2 all divided by 10 raised to power 4 now when I'm, I want to change this to multiplication therefore if I want to do that multiply by this one will now be 10 raised to power 2 or divided by what 2 raised to power 5 to, to change over now let's what can we do here I have 2 I have two. 
I have this one will be 2 raised to the power 9 minus 5 because this is power, this is division. Now, what of 5? 5 has nothing, which is 2. I have to multiply, multiply. What, a, what again? I have 10 to minus bracket of this particular, this particular, which is what? 3 plus 4. Now, this one will be 2 raised to power. 2 raised to power 4, multiply by 5 raised to power 2, multiply by 10 raised to power, 10 raised to power. I have this, I have this. That will be 7, which is minus 5. Now, I can now express my equation, you know, how to, this one can give me 16, this one can give me, but at least you can solve this now. It's not very hard, but you can do better, you can do it better. No, 2 raised to power 4, multiply by 2 raised to power 2, or divided by 10 raised to power 5. You can leave it like this. If you like, you can now express further. Thank you for watching. Next video, we will work on, we solve the two remaining questions. Thanks.